So now that we've learned a basic of how SNMP works at the packet level and how it works at the protocol level, we're going to move on and configure SNMP on this model. We're going to install and configure SNMP on a Windows 2019 server and we'll configure SNMP version 2 on Windows server because Windows server does not support version 3 of SNMP. And they recommend you to use WMI to monitor and manage their server and it's really like SNMP and you will see how to configure WMI later on on Windows in this model. And we also install SNMP on Cisco devices and VMware ESXi and Linux operating system in this course. So here we are on a Windows Server 2019 and you can easily install Windows 2016 or 19 on VMware Player or Workstation or VirtualBox to practice this course. The first thing we're going to do is to install SNMP Server on Server Manager. So on Manage, we'll click Add Role and Features. Next. So this is screen for role and we need the feature because SNMP is feature on Windows Server. And we'll scroll down to find SNMP service, which is here. Also we have SNMP WMI provider. And actually we'll click both of them. And we'll click on next and install. So as you can see, we successfully installed SNMP service through the server manager. So we'll hit close and we'll close server manager window here. So we'll type services.msc and we're looking for SNMP, which is SNMP service and SNMP trap. So we we'll double click on SNMP service and at the first we're going to configure security. So here in this box we should add community right here which is read only, read and write and read create. And actually this read create it will help you to create new entries on the SNMP databases but not actually overwriting the existing one. So we're going to say read only, here we'll say lab dot ro which is refers to read only and again we can add for read and write that's great the second box where you set up security for your snmp here this is good option for security because windows doesn't support snmp version 3 you can lock it down to only accept SNMP packet and send SNMP trap to a specific IP addresses. Here we'll specify NMS or network management system. And apply. And the next thing we're going to configure is trap tab here. This is where you enter in the information for the servers sending SNMP trap. Trap does not use the community string that we added in security tab. Here, as you can see, they are not shown here. Obviously, it's for security issues. So again, we will specify SNMP trap here. And again, here we can specify the server which is going to be our network monitoring tool, something like PRTG or App Manager, Zabbix, SolarWinds or whatever. Okay, and apply. So this is how we can configure SNMP on Windows 2016, 2019. It's very easy. So you might ask him, what is this guy SNMP trap down here? Actually, this is for allowing the server that you're on to receive trap messages generated by local or remote simple management agent to force the messages to SNMP program on remote computers. And it's kind of like trap forwarder. So that's how to install and configure SNMP on Windows Server 2019.